Hello YouTube and welcome back. My name is Kieran aka Kieran B and we are once again playing uh, Call of Cthulhu. Had a brain fart there. So uh, when we last left off we, uh, a very rich and annoying man uh, came and told us that his daughter wasn't a murderer or insane. So let's go find out if it's true or not shall we. Oh and apparently uh, there's an old angry god of the sea slash dreams but that's that's, that's probably non-existent uh pierce took the hawkins case the cursed artist is accused of having caused the fire that killed her and her family as the only clue she left her father a disturbing painting on the shipping label an address a warehouse set on the docks of the island of darkwater the place seems to be the starting point for pierce's investigation all right let's hope we don't run to any Fish people into madness. Leaves looking even seaworthy. Focus Home Interactive presents. A rugged man with a drinking problem. Wait, is he blind? Why do you have those eyes closed? The game by Cyanide Studio. Cold opening, yeah. Cold, this is bloody freezing. <laughs> uh, this is a cold light would pass through a diamond at about 20 miles an hour or something. All of Kazoo. Why do you have the registered trademark there? I, mean, I can imagine it is, but why do you constantly say that it is? Kind of odd. And we are here! Here, Cthulhu, 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 Cthulhu! Stay on board! There's guys coming to unload! Welcome to Darkwater Island, Mr. Pierce. Why, thank, thank you, you, Captain Fitzroy. So, what wind brought you? Does the Hawkins case mean anything to you? Oh, uh, yeah. Talk about it on the open. Everybody can hear it. Sounds like a great Charles idea. Hawkins may have been a landlubber, but he was a good man. And his wife, Sarah Hawkins. A uh, nice young woman. I suppose any new person is going to uh, be under suspicion. You know of what? Her. Go have a drink of the stranded whale. What you need is a good pick me up. Mitchell may not be very welcoming, but his bar holds a surprise for you. As for me, you'll find me at the harbor master's office. And I'm guessing you're the if only friend It's the Hawkins office. family that brings you here. I have a pile of documents that should interest you. Ooh. Understood. Do you love the I'm big pile of look dock? around the docks? Right. I do quite I do quite like this. This is actually very uh very much like murdered soul suspect, which is a very good thing. Uh bar talk to Bradley. Well, let me let the police do their work. Hey Sullivan. Can't you go any faster? You see how old this thing is? You force it too much, we'll break everything. Really? Can't do that. Like police here. But it's stuff. only a fish. A fish? 
<laughs> You've got no idea. Don't badmouth what you don't know. Or you'll pay for it for sure. Okay, that's enough. Step back and let us do our job. That's no way to treat an omen. Oh, yeah. He's gonna get us into trouble. You can't understand. You're precious, You're not sailors. It's a sign. There's something coming. Something real bad. Well, then it doesn't matter what we Don't do with the omen, is it? Don't back in the water, you shysters. You're crazy. The cops, they can't understand. Damn stupid idiots. Forget it. Nobody listens to us anyway. That's no way to treat an omen. Okay, he's oh, yeah. just going to keep the on The same talking. goes for you, sir. Move along. Uh, these sailors get upset over nothing. They seem to be very agitated about a dead animal. <laughs> You're telling me. These fools think that putting the whale back in the water will bring about the end of the world. <laughs> They're superstitious. If only you knew. They only listen to Captain Fitzroy. And not always. And you. What brings you to our island? I'm looking for this address. Warehouse 36. Darkwater Harbor. <laughs> I like you, so I'll be frank with you. Don't go near the place. Don't try to get in. Why? Because I told you so. Learn to accept some friendly advice. Now, please, allow me to do my job. You can't That's understand. No You're not sailors. There's a You can see that I'm busy, can't you? You can't understand. You oh. can't understand. No, okay. Don't put that oh, beast back in the water, oh, yeah. you yeah. The blood is just beginning to coagulate. It died a short time ago. Killer whales have few predators. And there are no sharks in these waters. What creature could possibly have done this? Mm. That's no way to try well, given the fact that there's a oh, giant yeah. stripe there. And another giant stripe there, and another understand. giant stripe there. Sailors. I'd say something, something with tentacles, something maybe. Don't put that beast back in the water, Hello. you shysters! You're crazy. They're cops. Oh, they can't understand. Damn I'm guessing I can't idiots. go that way because of the crowd. Yeah, so let's go to the bar. Let's go have a drinky poo. Well, what do you guys have to say for yourselves? There's nothing for you here me. either. What did he Big call text. us just now? I said you hmm. were a filled rat. And even a... A box limpet. You think we don't know what you're doing? Ooh. Now I'm ball? curious. I'll shut up your big mouth once and for all. Optimistic. Huh. Apparently there's some kind of... Uh, gang warfare going on. Interesting. Prohibition, Prohibition is that's just a, a word. Joke around here. That suits me fine. I knew that uh, somebody would bring it up eventually. Oh, I ho. <laughs> All right, well, that's one way to make an entrance. A stupid way, but it is one way. Let's get him another drink. He's dry. In my bar, we don't serve troublemakers. Wasn't me who went looking for it. Uh, hold this as eloquence. I didn't show respect. I do want my eloquence, so. You saw what happened. He's the troublemaker. Oh, you're a true mainlander. A real princess. You strut around with your la-di-da ways, and then, as soon as the pressure arises, you start squealing. You don't have what it takes to drink my whiskey. You've got to earn it. I'm here for information, not for a fight. I prefer it that way. Speak, then. I reserve the right to answer or not. Does that work? I have no idea. Uh, order a drink. 
Uh, no prohibition around here? I didn't expect to find alcohol on this island. What's the source of this miracle? You mean who? Our source of supply wouldn't like me to betray them to the first I guess it's the lady with the... I'll tell nobody. Smoke. She'd know it anyway. Yep. Anything else? Do you know where this place 36? is? Warehouse 36, Darkwater Harbor. The Hawkins Warehouse. I see, yeah. Oh, if it's I actually were their you, warehouse. I wouldn't hang around there. Why not? First off, there are rumors. Sailors from around here say you can hear noises coming from the warehouse at night. Screams, that sort of thing. Screams? And that's not all. There's the fate of its owners and all the superstitions that go with it. But I'll say no more. Anything else? Hmm. Uh, find out about dark water. Uh, why the stranded whale? The stranded whale. I guess this bar has been here a long time. What can I tell Especially you? Since uh, I'm a nostalgic it's apparently sort of a bad guy. omen. The name it reminds us of the golden age of dark water, when our whalers left for long months and came back sweating and stinking of the oil and flesh of the whales they'd been hunting. It was a tough time, all the same. Ah, but steeped in glory. We've never known such wealth since then. Yeah, one thing was very important, which they cut it out these days, but it's not. Uh, what can you tell me about her? We all knew she was famous on the mainland for her paintings. Never understood why. Then, I don't want to speak ill of the dead. Okay, not the, uh, not speaking ill if it's true, it's true that they were strange. Her style made her famous. How would you describe it? Tortured? Yeah, well, it wasn't normal. I mean, for a young woman with a child and all that. Oh, that's we saw them in the papers and we said to ourselves, who can paint such things? Is that how she sees the world? So they made you feel uncomfortable. You need to see them for yourself. Make up your own mind. Well, I think that... I think that, that was probably the entire intention was to make people uncomfortable. Her vision. Was it so terrible? The way I see it, the truth is really a question of point of view. What do you mean by that? Do you still trust the truth after a bottle of whiskey? I've got what I need. Anything else? Uh, no, I think we're pretty much done. Uh, find out about dark water. Yeah, no. Okay. That'll be all for bye now. Bye bye. I'm not gonna drink very much. This game, if I can avoid it. Oh, you are a bootlegger, I imagine. What you looking at, stranger? You can certainly put them away. Uh. Oh, so one like you in a place like this. I've rarely seen a woman who can hold her liquor so confidently. Hello. What gives you the right to judge me? Ah, it was a compliment. So what? Let me drink, stranger. Mm. Okay, jeez. Just kind of looking if you could uh, smuggle me off the island. Uh, that's absolutely going to be... Well, may as well. Do you like our song? <laughs> We're true sirens. It's not bad. We may it's not be this. pros, but we give it all we've got. That's <laughs> true. It's a That's reminder the of the time when we were still fishing for whales off Darkwater Island. What are you doing now, then? Fishing for fish? What brought whaling to an end? The whales, of course. They all disappeared. You exhausted the stocks. You could say that, yes. There were fewer and fewer of them. Until the last. The biggest. The one of the miraculous catch. <laughs> exactly. Huh. Okay. I've never heard this song That's before. That's gonna come up again Only later, I guess. people from here know it. It tells the story of the miraculous catch. Uh -huh. It's a local legend? Watch what you say, young man. That catch saved our island. 
Ah. Where's the proof? Where the proof? Without it, the whole of Darkwater would have died of hunger in 1847. It's true. Everything happened, just as it says in the newspaper report. What report? Uh -huh. The one that's framed right behind you. Our grandparents tasted its flesh. And it was delicious. Yeah, there's definitely more to that story. I bid you farewell, gentlemen. Good well, night, stranger. Let's try and find stranger. this newspaper then, huh? So long. That sounds like an I awesome idea. The of the girly boys men fly home. I don't know what they're saying, honestly. Oh, kind of learning. Hello. Nightmares. Can hear things and voices whispering. Will follow its reader and appear at various locations, gifted with its own consciousness, until it finds a new reader. First book. Okay. The miraculous catch. Apparently, the most significant event of the last eighty years. If it saved the entire, um, if it saved the entire island, then yeah, that would be pretty miraculous and pretty significant. The Chante, the name of the newspaper, 21st of May, 1847, miraculous catch. The Scylla, Scylla and Charybdis, I'd imagine. Where's Charybdis then? Uh, returns to port to save dark water from famine. We'd give no pope. The crew of the Scylla, or what remains of it, returned to Darkwater Port late on Tuesday afternoon. The locals immediately rushed to the docks to welcome the last whaling ship in the island. People were amazed at the sight of the unbelievable catch the brave vessel had on board. Of a size that went beyond that of the formidable tooth whales, the cetacean that is already being called the miraculous catch covered the whole deck and parts of it were hanging over the side of the ship. The surviving sailors told a frightening account of their perilous catch, but also of its meat, unmatched in its quality and plentiful nutritious benefits. There is no doubt that the immense size of this whale will allow numerous inhabitants of dark water to feed themselves, bringing an end to the famine from which part of the island was suffering. Warehouse for rent. Okay. Mr. Marks is putting his warehouse up for rent from June for fishing, workshop or storage activities you can contact him favorite newspaper or visit him on the dock. What's the bet that's Warehouse 36? Special evening at the Stranded Whale to celebrate the return of our brave whalers. All the staff of the Stranded Whale invite you to an exceptional and free tasting event. Come with your family or with friends to taste the miraculous catch. Each person will leave a bottle of will leave with a bottle of oil, so don't hesitate. So, the Stranded Whale was called the Stranded Whale before the Miraculous Catch. Didn't the innkeeper say that they named it Stranded Whale in, um, in remembrance of the times of whaling? And the Miraculous Catch was the last whale they caught? So, something doesn't quite add up there, but uh, maybe it's just a... Hmm, maybe it's nothing. Again, the Stranded Whale is a dark omen to the fishermen, so... Why would you name a, a bar after a dark omen? That seems... New clue memorized. I'm glad he's memorizing them. Seems a bit off. Honestly, that's the, that's the biggest thing I've learned here. Like, why is this... Place named after Bad Omen. That's member of a style asylum staff. Cold. She won't stop asking. Not that again. She will get us into trouble. Uh, I know. I know. Okay. Interesting. All right. Let's go. Uh, let's go talk to Fitzroy. I don't think there's anything else to do. I do quite like that actually. You can just walk in now. No, uh... Captain Fitzroy. Hawkins. Mr. Andrews. Always free for the... something. Charles Hawkins was a heavy drinker. And a debtor. Interesting. Uh, $60. 60, 
$68. Back in those days, oof, that's, that's heavy drinking, all right. But I take a guess and say that that's more like $500 at this point. Uh, what's around here? Wouldn't have to be a book on medicine or the occult hanging around, would there? Nah, that's not. That light has moved. It does. Cool. I am liking the atmosphere so far. Very good. Pretty much exactly what I was Broke. hoping for. This place seems half abandoned. Hmm. I wonder what Captain Fitzroy has got to say about this woman, Cat. Captain, the terms of our agreement are clear. Keep your men under control. You cannot afford to provoke us. No need to answer this message. Just make your payment to the carrier. I'm guessing Cat's the lovely lady who can keep her drink. That's absolutely zero time for us right now. Either she's going to save our lives or she's going to try and kill us. One or the other. Well, that's pretty much true of literally everybody here. Fishing equipment. <laughs> Could do with some rust remover. Mm -hmm. mm, the privy. Okay. Maritime bank. Sperm whale. There's a little whales there. Oh. A souvenir from a more prosperous era. Mm -hmm. I guess this blackboard hasn't been wiped for more than 70 years. Yeah, it looked like it. A Scylla. That's a pretty cool ship. It finished up beached at the entrance to the harbor. Oh, is it still there? Unless that's it over there, is it? Might be. Or over there. There's a couple of things, but I think they're pretty small. That's a big sailing ship, so... Yeah, let's go with that one. I'm just gonna... Stick my nose into your business, hope you don't mind. Learning of medicine, yay! Guessing that's 24? 24, okay. Christmas. This man and Fitzroy could be twins. Photograph of Captain Fitzroy. In this photograph, a man who looks like Captain Fitzroy is posing on the bridge of a ship. He has a wooden leg. Does? He does. Huh. I missed it. Okay. And what a macabre souvenir. Pretty sure it's pronounced macabre, but okay. You, you, you zany Americans with your zany pronunciations. Hello. Hang on. Just checking. I Hello. brought out the Charles <laughs> Hawkins cargo manifests. They're on Ooh. the table next to you. But in truth, you're likely to be disappointed. When you're done, what? come join me on the deck. I thought she said I'd be interested in seeing them. These manifests are signed by Charles Hawkins. But that's all I'll get from them. A few dates are still legible. 1890, 1907, and a partial date. The rest of the document is blacked out. Who would want this information to be hidden? Partial date. And I see the partial date. It was like 17 or something. Uh, that's 1890. That's 1907. And that's 22, I think. Looks like 22. Okay, so that was two years ago then? Alright. Um, I think this is 24, isn't it? Hmm. Okay. Uh, where are you? Here you are. Hello. I'm with you. From here, I see everything that goes on in the harbor. The hard-working lives of my sailors, the fights of the stranded whale, even the antics of these wharf rats don't escape me. It's you who lays down the law around here. 
Oh, I wouldn't go that far. I'm just the last serving captain on Darkwater. Tell me what I can do to help you. Ask him about... Your documents are unreadable. Talk about Darkwater... Well, let's do this. Their manifests have been blacked out. They're totally unreadable. Yeah, I so saw that. The ability to I've got that. no idea who did it or why. I don't remember having countersigned anything special enough for someone to hide it. And why obliterate the dates, as well as the goods stored in the warehouse? You mean that the dates have some meaning? Wait, what? Fishing. You mean whale fishing, not fishing fishing, right? Because if that's true, then... Yeah, why does nobody think that something weird is going on here? <laughs> Where are these people getting all their food? Uh... I'm surprised Charles Hawkins had goods to store, knowing that whaling stopped in 1847. Okay, right. I see that you're interested in the history of our island. Indeed, maritime activities ceased altogether at the end of the last century. What? I imagine that the Hawkins family had other types of contracts. But you don't know with whom? No. It was none of my business. Maritime activities all stopped. They're using fishing and whaling as a two... As like the same thing when they're not. Like, I, uh, I don't. And if, hang on, if they were going to starve, but then that huge whale came along, which was presumably a, a blue whale, then how are they still alive now? Let's talk about dark water. Um, this photo looks strangely like you. I saw the killer whale on the wharf. What's... If I can only check one, what am I going to check? Um, not this. Not this. It was cat. I found a threatening letter, signed by a certain cat. What? I don't mind you visiting my harbor master's office, but I'd prefer if you didn't go through my affairs. Are you being blackmailed? Not exactly, no. That shyster wants to make us pay protection money. Mm -hmm. With any success? I wouldn't say that. But she terrifies my men as much as her own. Can you not do anything to stop her? Don't you worry about that. Okay. Um, next, this one is probably... I was looking at your important. photograph. The one of the man in front of the boat. Ah, yes, I can see the one you're talking about. Interesting resemblance. I thought it was you, but with a wooden leg. And for good reason. That's my father in the photograph. Your father? John Fitzroy, captain of the Scylla. His wooden leg is here. You can go and see it if you're interested. It is. Huh. Uh, this is I'm just back morning. from the wharves. The dead killer whale is unsettling the sailors. Ah, yes. Us men of the sea are superstitious folk. Boons are unnatural. Why are they putting it back into the sea? I, I definitely want to do this. Well, it's obvious why they're putting it back into the sea anyway. Ah, oh, I really... Hmm... Annoying. I can't tell if this is going to end or not. Let's go. Well, I can. The police took the decision that. to put the killer whale back into the sea. You've got to understand them. They didn't know what to do with it. I think that was a mistake. Who says that whatever caused those wounds is no longer in these waters? <laughs> you think we should have kept it? To look into the real cause of its death, at least. I examined its wounds. I know of no creature able to cause them. Giant and squid. I took Giant you for jellyfish. a detective. Believe me when I say that these wounds are significant. Come, come. You've only just arrived on dark water, and already you think like a sailor. <laughs> yeah. 
Uh, what is this miraculous catch? The miraculous catch? Is it a local legend? Not at all. It's an episode from our glorious past. Go read the story of the sailor's return to Darkwater Harbor. It's displayed it on the wall of the stranded whale. Okay. Um. Ask him I'm looking works. for Warehouse 36. Do you know where it is? Look, it's right there. The warehouse is opposite the jetty. You can't miss it. Uh. Understood. There's a lot of buildings over there. You know there. who the, the building usual? belongs to, don't you? Yes, I do. Don't underestimate me. Oh. Don't it belonged me. to the Hawkins family. Precisely. Ship owners from father to son. I think that somebody here wanted me to search this warehouse. Uh, okay, so... Yeah. I shall be on my okay. way. So come back and see me when you've got something new. Okay, gained one CP. Oh. I have two. Um, buh, buh, buh. Yeah, they can only be improved by that. I'm actually glad that I did put uh, a skill into medicine as well, because of that. Um... Duh, nothing needs 2 CP right now, so I'll just leave it. Uh, how's my sanity looking? Oh, good. Even Webster, businessman. Prospected. 41. Charles Hawkins was a local celebrity on Darkwater, the heir of his ship owner family. Okay, well, that's fair. He used to travel a lot. He met Sarah Hawkins during a trip in Paris. They fell in love, got married, and Hawkins took her to the remote island of Darkwater. Hmm. See, now that's a little bit interesting. This is... This is the 20s. Um, don't know exactly, but there was the manifest for 70 which is for 1870, which would be 50 something years before, which means it would be his father. Hmm. Why did he take her to Darkwater? Would it be his father or was it him? Painter, a uh, painter known for her tortured artistic universe. She was worshipped for the strangeness of her work and the rarity of her public appearances. I just remember she once said, I paint what my dreams whisper to me. Uh, she to Charles Hawkins years ago, surprised high society columnist, a wealthy Boston heiress known for her party going, chooses to follow her new husband and live as a recluse on the island of Darkwater. She disappeared from the front pages of the newspapers and nobody heard any more about her. Even her death in a fire remained a secret, only her father. Even Webster continues to seek the truth. Huh, so nobody even knows she died. Interesting. There was something else that stuck out to me there. So her marriage to Charles Hawkins years ago surprised a wealthy Boston heiress known for her party going. Okay, so she... Did she... So she didn't paint until she got to Darkwater. Okay. Well, that would have been telling if it was the other way around. Because it would mean that... He found somebody who had these dreams and specifically and specifically took them to Darkwater. So that's interesting. Bill Boy, only son, he died in the fire of the Queen's Soul family. Okay. Understand well bar Golden Age of Wailing, yeah. He offered to help me in my investigation. Okay, uh the, the threatening letter, the photograph, manifest chapter one. Island Sarah Hawkins. Yep, uh, I've seen this. Uh, no. Medicine. Bring it. Medicine. Okay. Um. Yeah, I think that that's more or less everything. A cult. The miraculous catch counts as a, counts as a cult. Well. Yeah, I guess I would, huh? Oh yeah. Let's go. Okay, well, I am going to put a cut in now for YouTube. Um, thank you very much for joining me. Oh, I hope you're enjoying the series. Uh, like, subscribe, comment, favorite, ring the bell, 
uh, join my Discord server, follow me on Twitter, and I hope I'll see you again. Goodbye.